noun spelling rules wives roofs watches boys cats parties etc are the examples of plural nouns but dear students do you know when do we add ies ves s and es to make a singular noun plural no worries welcome to rj learning fun here learning is always fun and today in the series of b spelling smart lesson 7 we are going to look into some simple rules regarding pluralization but before that let's take a quick recap of what is a noun what are singular and plural nouns the name of a person place animal thing or idea is called noun for example john name of a person st peter school name of a place pencil name of a thing elephant name of an animal the nouns have two forms singular and plural singular nouns refer to a single place person or thing for example a mushroom a tree one thing plural nouns refer more than one person place animal or thing for example four mushrooms three trees more than one plural noun rule number 1 to change a singular noun into plural noun we add es to nouns that end in ch sh s x or z so if a word is ending in ch sh s x or z we will add es for example beach singular beaches plural wish wishes dress dresses bus buses box boxes quiz quizzes so all these words are ending in ch sh s x or z that's why we have added es to make them plural plural noun rule number 2 to change a singular noun into plural noun we add only letter s to nouns that don't end in ch sh s x or z now this one is the most common and simplest rule to just add letter s to the end of a singular noun if it is not ending in ch sh sx or z for example apple turn into apples pen pens parrot parrots teacher teachers book books ring rings we have just added the suffix s to show that it's plural plural noun rule number 3 to change a singular noun into plural noun we add ies to nouns that end in consonant plus y just drop that y and add ies so if any noun ends in y and there is a consonant before that you will just drop the y and add ies for example baby babies there is consonant b before y that's why we have dropped the y and add ies city cities consonant t before y cherry cherry consonant r before y berry berry consonant r before y puppy puppies consonant p before y that's why we have dropped the y and add i e s story stories s t o r i e s we have dropped the y because there is consonant r before y so if there is a combination of consonant plus y at the end of a word then drop the y and add i e s plural noun rule number 4 to change a singular noun into plural noun we add s to nouns that end in vowel plus y now this one is opposite to the rule number 3 that if the y is coming after a e i o u any of the five vowels not consonant then just add s do not drop y for example key keys here e vowel is coming before y that's why we have not dropped y we have just added s monkey monkeys boy boys o vowel is there toy toys day days guy guys so u vowel is there before y that's why we have not dropped y we have just added s so if vowel plus y combination is there then just add s at the end of the noun to make it plural plural noun rule number 5 we add ves to nouns that end in f or 
Fe. So remove F or Fe and add Ves. If the noun ends in fur sound, then remove the F or Fe and add Ves. For example, leaf, fur, remove F, L-E-A-V-E-S, calf, calves, C-L-V-E-S, shelf, shelves, wolf, wolves, knife, knives, wife, wives. So we have removed F or F-E and added V-E-S. Plural noun rule number six. We add ES to nouns that end in consonant plus O. So once again, previously we have added ES to the nouns that ended in CH, SH, S, X, and Z. Now we will also add ES to nouns that end in consonant plus O. For example, potato, potatoes, ending in O, and before O there is a consonant T. Similarly, tomato, tomatoes, echo, echoes, negro, negroes, hero, heroes. Before O, there is consonant R. That's why we have added ES at the end. Domino, dominoes. So now we know that we have to add ES to nouns that end in consonant plus O or if the noun is ending in CH, SH, SX, and Z. Plural noun rule number eight. Some irregular singular nouns change their spellings completely in plural form. So, regular singular nouns can be changed into plural form by adding just S or ES, but this is the list of some irregular singular nouns, and you will have to memorize their plural form. Child in plural form changed into children. Ox, oxen, man, men, woman, women, goose, geese, foot, feet, tooth, teeth, mouse, mice. So there are no rules for this. You will just have to learn them. Here is a list of some more irregular singular nouns. If a singular noun ends in US, replace it with I. For example, cactus, cacti, fungus, fungi, focus, foci, aluminous, alumni. And if a singular noun ends in UM, replace it with A. Datum, data, agendum, agenda, medium, media, bacterium, bacteria. And if a singular noun ends in IS, replace it with ES. Oasis, oasis. You will not find much change in the pronunciation, but a slight change in the spelling. Thesis, thesis. Basis, basis. Crisis, crisis. So, according to the spelling pattern, we have divided into different groups. Plural noun number nine. Some irregular nouns use their singular spelling as plural. So, their singular and plural form is same, no change at all. For example, fish, fish, caught, caught, aircraft, aircraft, sheep, sheep, deer, deer, swine, swine. Plural noun rule number 10. Some nouns have no singular form. They are always plural. So, you don't need to learn two forms. Just need to remember that these words cannot be used as singulars. For example, scissors, spectacles, shears, shorts, pants, jeans, tongs, forceps, pincers, series, species, and kettle. Dear friends, till now you have learned 10 plural noun spelling rules. Now here are some exceptions to that rule that you also need to know. This is first one is exception to the rule number five. Some words end in F, but they simply add an S. They do not change their endings to VES. These words are chief, chiefs, roof, roofs, cliff, clips. 
but there are some words that can have both the spelling correct scarf s c a r v e s and s c a r f s both are correct hoof hooves both spellings are correct h o o v e s as well as h o o f s this is exception to the rule number 6 some words that end in consonant plus o may have only s instead of es avocado avocados piano pianos if the word is an abbreviation then also we simply add s kilo kilos photo photos photo is the abbreviation of photograph that's why photo photos hippo hippos dear students you have just learned 10 plural noun spelling rules but every learning is incomplete without practice so here are some tables related to the singular plural nouns try to do these worksheets and give your answers to me in the comment section we'll be waiting for your answer hope you must have liked the video thanks for watching the video stay tuned in for my next video see you soon bye thank you